Hi everybody, and welcome back to another Laha Escapade. I'm Hannes. And I'm Laura. And today we're going to be showing you how you can make keepsakes. Um, we've got some slippers here that both of our kids wore. Um, unfortunately they're a bit worse for wear now. Worn out. <laughs> Completely worn out. But it's a bit sad to throw them away. So I thought that we could make some kind of keepsake that we can frame or put in one of the kids' um, baby albums. Um, for this you need keepsake, pen, paper, a phone or a tablet and a printer is handy but not necessary.
Yeah, um, it turned out pretty good. Yeah. Really happy with the way these turned out. I added a little bit of colour to this one, which we framed. Um, I just used colouring pencils, but you could go ahead and use uh, watercolours or anything, or even leave them just black and white. I left the smaller one that we did also just as it is. Um, quite tempted to make this one into a card. Mm. So this is the original size, no? Yeah, this is more original size. Um, so it's closer to the actual size of the slipper. And this one I made a little bit smaller. This is the one that I, I traced from the computer screen. Um, which is a really good trick if you don't have a light table or access to a printer. When I was a student, I did that quite often. <laughs> easy, easy does it. Yep. Um, you can also use a tablet, you just have to be a bit more careful because obviously if you put too much pressure, the um, image tends to move around. But that's another option if you want to do something like that. It doesn't have to be perfect, so when I was drawing it, I was quite um, loose with the way I was doing it. It didn't have to follow the lines perfectly. Because I wanted it to have more of a hand drawn feel, even though I did kind of cheat and trace a picture. Very good. So, yeah, so that's a way that you can keep hold of a keepsake without actually having to keep hold of broken shoes. <laughs> you cannot keep everything. No, <laughs> there's not room for everything to be kept. This would be a perfect thing for, for grandparents as well, for babies' first shoes and things like that that you can give to other people, as well as um, for just keeping for yourself. Yeah. Yeah. Find a spot on your wall? Oh, on our wall now? Yeah, it's gonna go on our wall. <laughs> and yeah, then you can look at it and remember the memories of your children running around in those shoes. Crazy times. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. So I hope you enjoyed it and catch us next time. See you next week. Ciao.